baseball from the Lone Star State. We've got open air baseball for you on the show. It's the Chicago White Sox taking on the Houston Astros. First pitch coming at you right after the break. So just about set. Here's Tim Anderson. Here we go, guys. Come on. Smoked on the ground a second. Into the outfield base hit. And the leadoff man aboard. Just a simple ground ball the other way. They had eyes on it, man. Sometimes that's all you need to do. Just let the ball travel, put the ball in play, and just hope it finds a hole. Luis Robert now to the right side and foul ball. And a pitch. Popped up to the left into foul ground over near the wall. Bregman is under it. And there's one away. That was a good hard fastball with some nice ride up in the zone right there. Hitter looked like he was on it, but I think that velocity at the end just beat him. Instead of a line drive or something hit deep, it's a pop-up and an easy out for the defense. Next offering is in for a strike. Right-hander kicks deals. The punch out there, and there's two down. Yoan Moncada with a chance to hit. So now one and two. One and two. And it's fouled away. The one two. Comes up empty as he chases that one in the dirt. To first. They don't come much closer than that. Bang, bang, play to end the inning. here in Houston. Here's the veteran second baseman, Jose Altuve. The pitch. Got him. And now one away. And Michael Brantley is going to come up to hit. Next pitch misses inside. Two and two. This to center field. Robert in position. Snags it for the second out. Two outs. Base is empty. Here's Alex Bregman. Third baseman. Alex Bregman. Here's a 1-1. Now one, one missed. The next offering misses. And the count is three, three and one. one. Three balls, one strike. The wind and the pitch. Smash to the left side. Knocks it down. Not in time, and he reaches safely. Runner at first following the error. Now it's Jordan Alvarez. This guy has turned into a beast. Chopped out in front of the plate. Fires to first on the run. And the inning is over. Back here at Minute Maid Park. Top of the second. Aloy Jimenez now. The why to kick the pitch. As a veteran out there on the ball, you're trying to establish both edges of the plate right here. He's working inside. 2-1 pitch is in there, and the count is even. Looks like he's just sizing him up there. Really good pitch to hit, but he took it all the way. Sometimes guys just want to set their timing later on in the game. That may be a pitch that he turns on. Here's a high chopper. The throw to first. Just got him on that one. And now up to the plate, Yasmani Grandal. Big time power. Ball to strike. In.
in the air right field and makes the grab and there are two outs two outs base is empty AJ Pollock at the dish the one one Way to lay off that fastball up right there. You're looking for something you see well that you can handle, but you also have to keep the discipline so that you're not popping up pitches that are... Well, we'll hold that thought as that's the third out and we'll end the inning. Bottom half of inning number two. Here's Guriel. Next offering is in for a strike. And the righty deals. Popped up first base side. Abreu settles underneath it. And out number one on the grab. Kyle Tucker, the next to hit. Kind of a throwback. No batting gloves. One down, base is empty. Little chopper rolls foul. Second inning here, no score. Swings and misses, two out. So next up for Houston, Chaz McCormick. Strike two. One and two. Count. Two down. Nobody on. And misses oh, inside. The wind of the pitch. And a foul ball. That was the emergency hack right there. And a pitch. And a foul ball. He stays alive. Kicks and deals. And that one upstairs. And he deals. Swing and a tapper. And he's safe at first. Jeremy Pena up next for the Astros. And the pitch. Late on that fastball. McCormick leads off first with two down to the inning. Lynn no. keeping an eye on him. And a pop-up right side, foul territory. Grabs it on the run. And that will end the inning. here in Houston. New inning getting started. Now it's the DH. Gavin Sheets. Swing and a miss. Two and now and two. two and two. The wind of the pitch. Swing and a miss. The velocity blasted it right past him. So up next for Chicago, Josh Harrison. Josh. So, a foul ball makes it one and two. Off the outside edge, and now the count is two and two. On the ground, right side. Fires over to first. Two up, two down. Stepping in, Tim Anderson. He's one for one, let off the game with a single. Next pitch is downstairs. Top of the third, no score. Next pitch misses inside. And now three and one. There's a swing and a drive. Way back there. Bangs off the wall. Safely into second. He's got a double. 
Well, that was one of those high percentage advantage counts where batting averages are just so much higher. So close to driving that thing out of here down the line and right. Just a little more behind it, and he's circling the bases right now. Still, though, put a really nice... Ah, that ends the inning, so we take a break. Set for the bottom of the third, and here is Martin Maldonado. One and two here. And a ball oh. evens the count. Two two. Two two now. And a swing and a miss. And one gone. Up next to so the Houston lineup turns over. Jose Altuve up to hit here. Good contact guy, good defender. Next pitch inside. Ball two. And a foul ball. The 2-2 two -two now. Liner to second and picked on the hop. Fires to first. And they get Altuve for the out. Two outs, bases empty. Down the number two hitter, Michael Brantley. Anderson to first. That ends the frame. And welcome back. And now the first baseman, Jose Abreu. Out to short. Sends it across to first. One up, one down. Well, he's doing a nice job of keeping the ball out of the air. Let's the defense work behind him with another ground ball. Good execution. Here comes the pitch. And that's ball four. Very close off the outside corner. Could have easily been called a strike in that location. Run around at first with one gone. Here's Aloy Jimenez. And a ball in two strikes. And a swing and a miss. And there's two away. Yasmani Grandal up to hit. He's not going to get cheated up there. No, he's not. He's looking to do damage with every swing he takes. That one ripped left field. He can't get there. It's a base hit. And that'll put runners at the corners with two away. Pena with a relay home. And he's out. Cut down and that ends the inning. here at the ballpark bottom four and now it's Alex Bregman next offering is in for a strike kicks and fires stays alive that one found hard the other way Next pitch is inside. Two and two. Inside, just missed. Really good take, especially with two strikes. Fouled off again, and it remains three and two. Well, he's desperately looking for that swing and miss. He's going to have to just change speeds a little bit try to move oh this one high and deep way back there and that is gone alex bregman sends it out and they jump ahead in the fourth it's one nothing here's jordan alvarez and a pitch and there's a ball but he's just got to delete it you give up that lead off home run go back to work focus on this next batter yeah, the 2-1 hammered, but foul. This guy's seen two change-ups in a row. Could be a little vulnerable for a fastball right here. Swing and a miss. And he's down on strikes. One down. Yuli Gurriel comes up to hit. 
He's got a nice, short, compact swing. Doesn't swing and miss a whole lot. The pitch. Out to short. That one sizzling on its way through to the outfield. So they get a man aboard with a one-out single. Everything came together perfectly for him right there. Everyone's trying to elevate the ball in today's game, but if you can hit a ball that hard on the ground, it's going to find some holes. Here's Kyle Tucker. Ground ball right side. Dives, but it kicks off his glove. Throws to first, and Tucker is retired. And stepping in for the Astros, Chaz McCormick. A 1-1. One, one. Dives for it. Got it. Makes the play. Welcome back. Now, A.J. Pollock. The two on. Just That's off the ball. inside edge. Now in this three ball count, down in the ball game, you've got to be very selective. Take your walk if they'll give it to you. And there's ball four. Maybe a little loss of focus on the mound right there. Pretty much gifted in first base with a quick free pass. No outs. Runner at first. Here's the White Sox DH. Gavin Sheets. He was a strikeout victim his first time. Checks over to first. Back safely. Right-hander deals. Pollock on at first. Nobody out. Next pitch way upstairs. With two strikes. May see some movement over there at first base. Try to stay out of a double play here. 3-2 now. The pitch. Swing and a high fly ball to left. Brantley makes the play, and there's one away. Now it's the second baseman, Josh Harrison. Righty delivers, and that one a little bit high. Well, these guys have had a hard time scoring in this one. The guy out there on the mound wants to keep attacking, make sure that they don't get any confidence. That one ripped left field. Pulls it in on the warning track. And now the shortstop, Tim Anderson. The 1-1. One -one. And that's in for a strike. One and two is the count. And now it's one and two. And a swing and a miss. And that's that. Ready to go for the last half of the inning. Now it's the shortstop, Jeremy Pena. And here it comes. And a count one and two. Right-hander kicks deals. And down on strikes he goes. And there's one down. Martin Maldonado up to hit. This is a guy who is very highly regarded defensively. Fun to watch him control stuff behind the plate. Good game caller. Good at framing. But it's that big arm that really stands out. Swing and a miss, and he struck him out. Two gone now. Here's the former MVP, Jose Altuve. One and two now. Altuve waits. Good eye right there. You come into the game knowing that unless the ball's in the dirt or gets by him, we're probably not going to steal anything today. So that's where you want to get a little more aggressive on your secondary lead and hope that some base hits, some slogs, some home runs can come into play. Chopper right side. Over to Abreu. And the Astros put down in order. Back here in Houston. Top of the sixth inning. And now it's Luis Robert. The pitch. 
but I'll say this as a former position player and base stealer, when you come into a game and you've got a guy like this behind the dish with a big arm, you really have to change your approach. Can't try to steal because you'll get thrown out. Maybe get a little bigger lead, be aggressive on the secondary, but this type of guy shuts the running game down. Got him. And that's the first out. Jose Abreu up to hit. The pitch. And downstairs. That's a really good take. Three and two now. Popped up. And it drops in. So a man aboard now with one away. So now it's the four hole hitter, Yoan Moncada. He's 0 for 1. And the righty deals. That one well upstairs. And the count is 3 and 1. At the belt and fires. On the ground, the third might be two. Bregman lost the second on the first double play. And that's the inning. Bottom of the six. And stepping in for the Astros, Michael Brantley. Next pitch misses, and it's three and two. He should get a pretty good pitch to hit here with the three-hole hitter coming up if he's walked. In the air, center field. Robert makes the play, and there's one down. Now it's Alex Bregman. He's already homered in this game. one popped to short Anderson settles underneath it and puts the squeeze on it that's out number two and next to hit for now Houston your Don Alvarez your Don Alvarez and he swings and lifts one to deep center field and that ball is gone Jordan Alvarez circles the bases, and they add to the lead. It's 2-0. Bases empty with two away. Now it's Yuli Gurriel, one for two. And a pitch. Oh, now this one's high and deep. Way back there, on its way, gone. Yuli Gurriel bops one out of here. And they tack on to their lead. It's 3-0. So next up for Houston, Kyle Tucker. And a 2-1 on the way. Puts it in the air out towards left center. And that one pulled down by Jimenez. here in Houston. Here's the left fielder, Aloy Jimenez. The pitch. Swing and a slow roller. Whips it across. And the leadoff hitter set down to open the seventh. And now the switch hitting catcher, Yasmani Grandal. 1-1 one, one down. And that one almost got him. Straightened him up a little bit. Two balls, one strike. The count two and one. Bottom of the zone and a called strike. And it really looks like these hitters have been in between with their timing today. Good fastball, excellent slider, but they've not been able to commit to one velocity and stay there. ball four he missed down low well it might be time to dig into that bullpen he's looking a little fatigued to me one gone runner at first and up next for Chicago A.J. Pollock and the pitch and that's in there at the knees 
Now, this guy's definitely looking for a big swing of the bat right here. Try to close that gap. But, you know, at the very least, if you could find a way to manufacture that run from first, it feels like it's really important to getting back into this ball game. Gavin Sheets will hit next. Next offering is down low. And yeah, that's ball two. Left-hand batter waits. Fouls one off. Two and two. Two outs. Got him looking. That's his second strikeout. Ronaldo Lopez will take over here, and he'll do his best to keep this close. Number 40. And welcome back. Now, here is Chaz McCormick. Slice down the right side. The wind of the pitch. On the ground to the left. And that's just foul. That one fouled off. Next offering is downstairs. The wind and the pitch. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. Now one away. Jeremy Pena up next for the Astros. Right-handed reliever. That's where you want it. It's a good miss. Two and one's the count. That one in for a strike, two and two. That front door slider is such a devastating pitch. You don't want to get beat by the inside fastball, so you cheat a little bit, and then by the time it gets there, it's out of the swing play. Up the middle. Now the throw to first on the run. Two up, two down. Martin Maldonado up next for the Astros. Who's over for two with a pair of strikeouts. And a 1-1. One, one. And that one off the outside edge. Two balls, one strike. Swing and a miss, and he is down on strikes for the third straight at bat. Back here at Minute Maid Park, we go to the eighth, and now Josh Harrison. 2-2 Two -two now. Just misses with that one. Riding to the plate. In the air, right field. No trouble here. Puts it away for the out. And there's one down. Back to the top of the White Sox lineup. Here's the shortstop at the play. Tim Anderson. Kicks and deals. And another ball. The 2-1. Swing and a miss as he was out front. Just an outstanding job of spinning the baseball, moving it around, doing what he does. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. Two away. Now Two outs. Base is empty. Now here is Luis Robert. Two down. Nobody on. On the ground right side. He steps on the bag and the inning is over. Back here at the ballpark, bottom of the eighth. Here's the Astros' leadoff man, Jose Altuve. Three.
three and two now. That one is absolutely belted back there. Grabs it right up against the wall. And he hammered that to straightaway center field. It's a deep part of the ballpark. Tell you what, that wind is blowing straight in. Got to be a big man if you're going to go through the wind of that part of the park. It just knocked that ball down. And that one is lifted in the air. And that one pulled down by Jimenez. And they get Brantley for the out. Out number two. Now, that now the third baseman, third Alex baseman. Bregman. Alex Bregman. But why to kick the pitch? Hit on the ground to the right side. He handles it himself, and that'll do it. So here comes Ryan Presley to the mound, trying to protect this lead. Number 55, Ryan Presley. Welcome back. And here's the first baseman, Jose Abreu. And the pitch. Yeah. Well, in this one, the offense has sputtered. Somebody's got to find a way to get on, keep the line moving, and manufacture at least one run. Then maybe you get two or three. Bounce to the left side. And it goes just foul. And a pitch. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. And one out now. now and now Yohan Moncada. The pitch. And a ground ball to first. He takes it on his own. Now only one out remaining. Now the left fielder, Beloy Jimenez. Next one misses, two and one. And the White Sox down to their final strike. Well, and those hitters count sometimes can be a little too aggressive, and a good pitcher will play off of that. He's got to get a better pitch to hit. And a swing and a miss, and that is the ball game. Great pitcher's duel in this one. You get to a certain point where... Each pitcher is trying to outdo the other, go a little bit deeper into the ball game. And for these guys, it really came down to a few key at bats. This was a fun one to watch. A shutout in this one, three nothing. Our final score for Chris Singleton and our entire outstanding crew here at MLB The Show. I'm John Shambi. We'll see you soon. Astros, three runs, five hits, no errors. They left three men on base. 